Hi everyone, this is Chef Mark. And I'm Cleek Cracker. And this is Pro versus No. We're here at the Appliance Factory flagship store and we're gonna, so this week we're gonna be dicing onions. Oh no, you're gonna make me cry. That's right, I'm gonna make you cry. All right, so the best way to cut an onion without crying yeah. for me is I just close my eyes. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, so here's how you hold the knife. Pinch grip. Okay. You're gonna pinch the blade of the knife with two fingers, three fingers underneath. You're gonna set the knife down. You're gonna pick up and pull. That is the return stroke. Forward and glide is the cut stroke. Pick up and pull, forward and glide. And with this application, we're using more of the back of the knife okay. to do the cutting. We're also gonna do something more of this backwards cut where I'm holding the knife level. Yes, exactly, that's good. Okay. And then finally, we're gonna be doing a fillet cut. So take one generous step backwards, lay your knife flat on the board with your thumb on top, and we can run the knife across the board. It's hard to do up here, it will slide on you okay. and you don't have any control. Okay. So this is the root end. Mm -hmm. I like to leave the root end on. That's gonna be the nucleus that holds the thing together when we cut it. This is the non-root end. So I'm gonna cut off the non-root end. Okay. I'm gonna cut the onion in half, intersecting the root end. So far, so good. Okay. We're gonna peel it, leaving that root end on. I like to take an extra layer off sometimes. This is a little leathery and hard to cut through. Sides? Yeah, let's just do one side. Okay. That's because I, you have to go back to work after this, and I want you to be able to have all your fingers and toes. <laughs> well, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, everyone. Holding our knife with our pinch grip. Watch this, okay? I'm gonna have the knife way out here in left field. And I'm gonna pull back, and I'm gonna have the knife strike the cutting board all the way down to the, the bottom of the cutting board, but not through the root end. So we're gonna call that are down cuts. Okay. Forward? Yep. Okay. Good. Okay, next step. I'm gonna have my onion, I'm gonna turn it with the root end facing to the left. I'm gonna take one nice step backwards. I'm gonna lay my knife in the fillet motion, okay? And watch this, I'm gonna use the back of the knife as a pivot point to help kind of steer. I got ballerina fingers on top, so I'm gonna to make, let's just make one cross cut. You can make more if you're trying to cut it smaller. Okay. All and not all the way through. Oh. Okay. Okay. Now, now that we have that, we're gonna go ahead with that forward rocking motion. <laughs> we're gonna slice our onion into a beautiful dice. I think it looks great. <laughs> Let's take a look here. There we go. That's not bad. Now, 30% of the onion is laying on the floor. And the beautiful thing about cooking in other people's kitchens is that you don't have to clean up the mess you make. Yes. Very good. <laughs> this has been Pro. Versus No. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe. See you next time.